I'm Kat Solar. So the Snake Eyes video was a very exciting, intense project. Um, we knew that uh, we wanted to create something that was edgy and showed sort of a different style of Cat Solar than we had seen before. Hi, I'm Jay Max, and I am uh, Cat's co-creative director. Um, we basically worked on the album together, co-writing the songs. Uh, I had the amazing opportunity to co-direct the Snake Eyes video with her. The Snake Eyes video concept really, it was something that evolved. You know, at one point we had this like idea of something that was going to be very exotic and we kind of were trying to figure out how we were going to bring this like worldly feel of the song uh, and translate that to video. You know, we brought in my boys, the two dancers that I used in my shows, and a snake. And really, I guess it started from the obvious thing that we did want to incorporate uh, a snake. I mean, that imagery is very powerful. It's, um, in some ways, it's very sexy and seductive, and it's also kind of dangerous. So we were kind of playing with that, because um, that's also kind of what the song is about. Um, and so we, we started from there, and then the concepts just started evolving. It's very hard to wrap in all of her into, you know, one story, but for Snake Eyes, always have this feeling of something kind of uh, outside of this world. And it ended up being almost this mythological type of imagery of, like, these, these different goddesses and these different sides, I guess, of cat and maybe of a lot of women and kind of like personifying um, these, these creatures and these goddesses. So the snake was named Bo. It, he um, was a, a huge boa constrictor that uh, I was terrified of at first. I've never been around a snake. Um, you know, he came with his trainer, who was uh, really frightening in his own right. Um, so, like, all together, I, I was very frightened of Bo. Plus, I was wearing no clothing, um, you know, lying on this sort of surface. And um, my introduction to Bo for the first time was in this, you know, very vulnerable position, basically naked on the ground. And then there was one point where the snake was coming up in the scene where it goes over my shoulder and he started wrapping himself around my neck, which is, that was really scary. Um, they, you know, the trainer was like, oh, it's fine. And I could see him like kind of like getting tighter. And I'm like, I'm not sure. I mean, when a, a boa constrictor starts wrapping itself around your neck, I don't think it's really, um, yeah. So that was, you know, sort of a moment, but no one else seemed too worried about it or they didn't care. I'm not sure who's one or the other. Who is Cat Solar? Um, Cat Solar is like, in one way, she's this larger than life, like female superhero, James Bond type character. You know, like when I see her on stage or on video, sometimes I forget that, you know, I'm friends with her and I work with her because she's like this, this, I don't know, this like being and she's so confident and she just has this energy and I mean, I guess that's just the way that Kat is, because even in real life, she just draws all these people to her, and people that want to be a part of the team and a part of the project, and it's like people that we've gotten to know from the beginning are a part of this family. Jay and I, we are often in sync on things. It's like he could finish my sentences, or, you know, I, he'll, I'll have an idea and he'll expand upon it, and, you know, back and forth all the time. So there's sort of this like shared uh, thing all the time, this special communication that we have. So that's, I mean, that that's amazing. That's a gift. I think, you know, that's kind of like the magical thing that we have together. 
for everyone on my team, there's always so much love and there's so much uh, togetherness. It's like a family.